I just like the sound. back to another video and in today's video I'm going to be talking to you about why I chose to go with a car I've got today so my Ford KA so it all started when I was like just past my test so I just finished like past my test and I didn't have a car like lined up for when I'd passed um, just a pure fact of I didn't have anywhere to kind of keep it at first and my parents didn't want me to get the car and it just sit there and rust sort of thing and not been running that so I was like okay what can I get that's gonna be cheap to buy it's not expensive on insurance neither is it expensive on tax or petrol and just in general to run so I was browsing the internet uh, I was looking at several different cars. I looked at Honda Civics. I looked at the KA. I looked at Corsas. I looked at MGZRs. Uh, Fiat Punos. Um, Vauxhall Astras. Another type of Honda Civic. Like the bigger one. I, I looked at all sorts. And this car kept coming out of the cheapest, and I was adamant I didn't want it. Um, I didn't like the look of them. Uh, to me, I, I don't know, I just don't like the car, or I didn't like the car at first. <clears throat> and then my parents kind of made me see sense. They were like, if you just kind of get your first year insurance out of the way, in, with this car, your price will drop in insurance, bearing in mind nothing happens. Um nothing has happened but you know like fingers crossed it don't um but you know it's just kind of like one of those things you need the price to drop so you need to get kind of a bad car at first to price to drop to kind of get a better car and obviously i'm kind of like guys just staring at me what the hell okay <laughs> so obviously i've got this i'm going to do my first year insurance um and then I'm going to be, obviously, getting the Astra. So, this is that's basically why I got the car, was just for the first year insurance, so then I can get a better car, a.k.a. the Astra. Um, <clears throat> the other alternative was an MGZR. Uh, it was going to cost me £450 to buy the car, where I only paid 400 for this. Well, it wasn't even 400 it was like 380 I knocked the guy down like 20 quid. Um, or I spend an extra 50 quid, so I was like, okay, I wanted the MGZR, it's a nice looking car, so I was going to go for it, so I contacted the person, but the car had sold, so I, okay, <clears throat> and it was only a pound more on insurance than I'm paying now, so I was like, that's a bonus, it's quite a nice looking car for a first car, cheap on insurance, obviously a pound more I'm paying now, same as my road tax that I'm paying now, but obviously I've sold. So I tried searching everywhere for an MGZR and I couldn't find one. Well, I found one but it had no MOT. It needed a lot of work doing to the engine and I didn't want all the hassle with that. I just wanted to get a car, be able to drive for the first year and get a better car after. So that's why I went with this car. I mean I get a, little pe a lot of people going on oh, such an ugly car. Okay, cool, it's an ugly car, but at least I've got a car. At least I can drive. Half these people that are telling me it's an ugly car and all of this, they can't drive, they don't have a car. So, you know, like, I'm not bothered by it. Like, my car's my car. It gives me A to B, and at least I can drive, like I said. Um, but, you know, that's pretty much why I got the car. Um, I do plan on getting the Astra by at least the middle of... A year, say next year, I'm hoping. Um, see, I'm saving for it. Um, so, yeah, that's going to be the video for today, guys and girls. I hope you enjoyed. Like, share, and subscribe. So blooming hot today. Um, and I'll see you in the next video.